Through our lifetimes, we may have four or five changes of career. I myself have done the fashion business, I've done electronics, I've done interior design, and now I'm doing an online academy. I think what's very, very important is your CV. You need to have a great CV because it's the first thing that people see. And you need to tailor that to the job you're after. Um, see the pivot as an opportunity. This could be an opportunity. You may, maybe you've been coasting in your job before and maybe now you've got the chance to actually gain new experience to show your expertise. And don't be afraid to seize an opportunity. The fact that the job market is turbulent can make it the right time because job security, uh, not necessarily you may get a new job. So I would say that really and truthfully, if this is your time and you've got an idea, you've got to have a go at a new experience, don't be afraid. Don't be afraid of, don't hang on to the old, embrace the new and have a go. I'm never one for just being patient and seeing what happens. If you're on furlough, you should be thinking about what you can do now. So yes, you can look for a new, you can look for a new job, but also exercise the skills that you have got. Think how you can put those skills to use, to maybe start something of your own and to look for a new job at the same time. I mean, perseverance, hard work, what are your transferable skills? Because that is very important. Communication, decision-making, leadership, you know, use this, network, make contact. Don't think about what you could do, think about what you can do. And transferable skills are key. Challenging times can bring opportunity and they can present opportunities. Look for the industries that are thriving and surviving through COVID. Those are, that's where you should look to go. Where you think this industry, there's lots of them. Look at, never before, look at our medical profession. We need some medical supplies. We need delivery people. There's, there are things that are very, very important now, and that's where the young people should look to go. Go into the service. Most of the young people have got online skills, and that's very, that is very useful now. So there's lots and lots of things. The car business, for instance, we're told public transport, avoid public transport. So this is the key, is to look for what's important, thriving and surviving post-COVID.